Hey YouTube, it's Aisha Everything and I am back with another video. Pass me my This one's for the vets. Hey Claire, you cooking It's Jane. Hey! She got drip like a flood. That's just understood. She gon' need more than a dub. That's just understood. Yeah, she pretty but she hood. If that's just understood. Going straight home from the club. to share this product with you just in case you wanted to purchase this brand yourself or even purchase this exact product just to see you know what can you fit in it how can you wear it things of that sort so stay tuned for that I will be showing you that in the next clip feast your eyes on this baby here Alright, so let's get into some of the details of this bag. This bag is the Patricia Crossbody Wallet from MCM in the color Hot Coral. Here is some info that you can find on MCM.com to learn more about dimensions and pricing. So when you purchase this bag, they will have it placed in a box that's made like this. You can also use this review to see if a bag is authentic, to see if the box they put it in is authentic, things of that sort. I don't know if this matters, but um, they left this on the box, I guess, to be able to determine maybe how many boxes they let out, I'm not sure. But this is what it looks like on the bag. It has that same look on each side now when you open it this is how it looks and um, the bag is out of course but it comes with this sack so this is I'm sure to keep your bag clean so this is how that looks just in case you're ever again to check if something is authentic this is what it should look like it's just CM and then this what comes inside of the box so looks like pack it to keep it clean hmm a little card that says one what does that say one year limited warranty I haven't even opened it as you can see um, I just went straight for the pack. oh let's see what else um, do not, a do not remove this tag. Last but not least, code. Okay, so that is what you can all find. So now we are going to open her up so that you can see what it looks like on the inside. So this is opening, and as you can see, it's like a click, I guess, click to push class. I just pushed this together and then it opened. And sorry, I got my cards and stuff in there. But this is what it looks like when you open it, okay? So it looks like you have multiple places to put cards multiple places to put cards and then you have this change slot here for, to put loose change and I'm gonna open that up too so you can see and then you have your you can take this off so I guess if you want to wear it as a clutch you can just unhook these and then just wear it as a clutch as well as a bag. So now, let's talk about what we can fit in this baby. Um, my birthday was May 14th, so it has been about maybe a month or so since I've had this bag. And let me tell y'all something. This not the bag, if you one of those girls that be having like hand sanitizer, uh, baby wipes, um, uh, multiple versions of lip glosses I mean I can keep going on and on if you're that girl this is not the bag it's not the bag sis 
the bag you need is a much bigger bag this bag can hold nothing and i'll be showing you exactly what this bag can hold so if you are the card lady meaning you own many different cards um this is the most ideal bag um if you just essentially think more wallet when you're purchasing or you're interested in buying this bag you need to think more i need a wallet not i need a real bag this is more of a wallet so um i'm going to try to fit what i can here just so you can see what all can go i'm going to add this lip gloss that i got from target by the way don't judge me but I keep one of these on me because I'm always wiping my screens off, like my cell phone screen. So I'm going to add this in there as well. And I'm trying to condense. And then I have the 11 Pro Max. I'm going to attempt, keyword attempt, to put my phone in here. Okay, I just want y'all to see. So it's in there, you see it's it's in there. And look at it from that side, from this angle. Okay, so now I'm pushing hard to try to, you see that? Barely, <laughs> barely, okay. Um. Yeah, so, I mean, I'm not gonna say you can't force your phone in there, or maybe if you have a smaller phone, so maybe if you don't have the Max, you might be good to go, but if you have the max, uh-uh, uh-uh. Not if you got a lip gloss or anything else like that in there. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave my phone in there and I'm gonna take the lip gloss out, okay? So now it's just my handkerchief, my cards, and my phone. So now, this is what it looks like. Now I'm gonna try to, still struggling, but okay. So. My phone is in there, guys. However, um, I'm just gonna be honest. Me personally, I have never, and I probably won't ever put my phone in my bag because when I tell y'all this is heavy as crap now, and although I know this chain is very sturdy, very sturdy, um, it's not too, too heavy, but it's a good, it's, it's, I, I would say it's a good weight. Um, I just don't wanna risk the, chances of me living my best life out in these streets of Atlanta and breaking my purse in front of everybody no ma'am that's not gonna be me so with that being said I am probably not gonna do this but if you are somebody who has like again a smaller phone or if you just absolutely have to have your phone in your purse it does work like it's in there it ain't going nowhere it's in there sis but me personally, I wouldn't. So I'm going to take my phone out. And I'm going to just add back in my lip gloss here. And this is what it looks like. And this is much lighter. Like, this is perfect. I think if I wanted to add like a lip liner, I definitely could add that. I probably would add my lip liner inside of this compartment where the um, change would normally go and that's it I don't know sis I don't know if a charger can fit in here um, just know you have to pick one it's either you gonna pick phone you gonna pick lip gloss you gonna pick charger you gonna pick what else them just the top three things I could think of you gonna have to pick one all three of them cannot go all two of them can like it's just not happening with this bag but like I said this still is a great bag I mean as far as, as far as it goes when you're thinking about a wallet this is a perfect 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 bag I would say this is a perfect good class I never had it to randomly open up on me I think it's pretty much secured and as I was showing you guys earlier you just do this and it opens right on up. One thing I will say about this bag though, I've only had it again, you all, for maybe three and a half weeks for to, to a month. And um, I don't know if you can see this on camera, but it's a bit dingy back here. It's not on the front, but it's a bit dingy back here. And I really think that's due to it rubbing against like my jeans or my clothes. 
Um, so that's one thing about buying bags that are this color or lighter bags. You're going to have that problem. Um, you're going to have the problem of your clothes rubbing off into the leather, things of that sort. I'm sure it's something I can buy to clean this with. I just haven't yet because it's not a priority. However, um, outside of that, outside of that little dinginess on the back, I love this bag. I'm gonna stand up so that you all can see how far it comes down on me. I'm 5'2", so keep that in mind. I'm 5'2", so just, yeah. I'm about to stand up so you can see it. Okay, so this is the bag next to me. All right, I'm going to put it on. All right, I'm on my tippy toes so you guys can kind of see. This is it to the side. Who was that? Where was that? This is it. She sits, to me, I feel like it sits at a perfect, just for it to just be on this shoulder, to me, this is perfect. Like, it's not too long, not too short. It's right there. Now, if I wanna cross body it, let me show you where it sits. Okay. So, cross body is right there, boom, right there on my hips. I think this is the perfect, perfect length for it to sit. So, yep. So this concludes our product review of this bag. Absolutely love this bag. I hope you all enjoyed this as well. And if you decide to purchase this bag, please let me know in the comments below. Make sure you thumbs up this video if you found it informative. And I will see you all in the next video. Thank you so much. See you soon.